let me look at my overall damage. Okay. Ain't gonna show overall. Let's just look at them one by one then. Alright, so on Quagmire, we, I did like 881. On Quagmire, the second. Alright. The bug stroke. Did some damage on that bog stroke. Call of Fang Enchantress. No, I don't really care about those. I'm gonna just, those are just add packs. Look at that boss damage, man. Who is this? Oh, that's that. That's that. <laughs> that's that fail Zulamon. That's what that is. That's uh, Achilles, Achilles on Achilles on whatever the heck that is. I don't know. Shoot, I was doing some little damage in that. Great right, man. I was doing some really little damage. This is my Karazhan that I did uh, a couple of days ago. I was pushing some decent damage. This is one I didn't really have on my gear though. I didn't have this ring, I didn't have these pants. Yeah, no, I literally didn't have my ring or pants. That's the only two pieces that I didn't have. Oh, shoot. Growbear, he said he just started playing. Oh, oh, wow. He... He just started playing, bro, and he's that freaking geared? Like, Jesus Christ, dude. I must be doing something wrong. First mistake I took was going rogue and trying to raid. Okay. Alright. What the heck? Starting off weird. Did our wait, was that our healer or something? Did the healer walk out? Oh, fit. Oh, dang, man. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Bro, I need to notice the healer walked out, man. Dude. Dude. Uh, that's crazy, man. I had this little food right here. I probably should have grabbed something at the guild ring, man. So I had a bunch of food that I placed up in there. Okay, that rogue. I don't know if I seen a 70 rogue sitting down in stealth, man. I would instantly take out the daggers, ambush, ambush backstab him. It's just easy claps. You can't really go wrong with a, a rogue sitting down. You feel me? You can't at all. Roots and down is like br breakfast, lunch, and dinner all at the same time. But you got Gordon Ramsay in the back cooking all the food. Man. Man, I don't know. Personally, if somebody was sitting down, and I'm, I'm right there, especially clothies, never sit down around me, man, because actually not even going to know you sitting down around me, because I'm being stealth already, lurking, finna clap you, because that's how I play as a rogue, and I'm pretty sure that's how all other rogues play too, lurking, daggers and swords, lurking, just trying to see your every move, trying to see what you're trying to do. And the second you sit down, boom. Sometimes they don't even wait. If, sometimes I don't even wait if you sit down. Sometimes if you just look like you ain't geared, then I'm going to just run up, boom. I bet a lot of people say that rogues are cowards. No. No. You're just weaker. Get your... I, I don't know where I was going with that. Uh, I was about to say something. Like, 
get your game up, not your blame up. There you go. Yeah. I have a carrier and I actually recorded it on my uh, tank. Come on, God. I recorded the entire thing. It was crazy. Uh, we didn't have any problems because um, my tank was a pretty beefy tank, or was considered a pretty beefy tank at the time. So we ain't really had any problems. But it was pretty dope. It was fun. We was moving through it pretty smooth. We had a pretty geared group, or it was considered a geared group at the time. So, uh, double Drew healer ain't, ain't bad at all in PV area, uh, PVE rating, but in PVE dungeons, like heroics and stuff like that, I don't know, they just, I don't know if I'm like running with like a, they just scare me, like they, they get you scared, like your health starts to get super low, oh, this guy isn't that all that geared, I mean, I had, a, I remember I was running a late night mana tombs, right? I was doing a freaking, it was a three hour, three or two and a half hour freaking Manitoums run. It was insane. I was like, what the heck? Why is this Manitoums taking so long? Everybody, because everybody was geared. It's a crazy thing. I was geared, uh, or at least, I was, I was geared enough to run Manitoums. You feel, you feel me? I was geared enough to run Manitoums, but... And everybody else was too. Because I thought Manitoons was going to be some easy badges. I actually think I was trying to get something out of Manitoons. I think it was like some Waste Walker stuff. Yeah, I was trying to get these legs right here. I don't need them anymore. But I was trying to get some Waste Walker legs. We couldn't even down the last boss. I was like, what the heck? We got close. We got like freaking 15% on them. Uh, it's not that close, but like. That's the closest we got in to downing them. And it was just so disappointing because all the DPS look so geared. And I was like, this one, at the start, I said, this going to be a clean run. We wiped on the first few mobs. I was very disappointed. Oh shoot, I'm supposed to be killing the totems. Did I just kidney? Oh my gosh, dude, I just wasted my freaking combo points. Since we pressed number three again. Dude, I've always hated dueling druids inside PvP. Druids are just the worst, especially freaking tree druids. Tree druids, they, they're sick. Especially in arena. I, I was getting against a druid in arena, dude. This is insane. It's like because they burn you down slowly. They they heal themselves a lot and they'll burn you down slowly. Like you can't kill them. It's impossible to kill them. Even in my PvP spec, it was hard for me to kill him. I gotta really try to like catch him out of their form, catch him out of their tree form, if you wanna really kill him. God dang it! Freaking pop my blade for you in a rock! Oh my god! Uh, 
Uh, yeah. I just, I just don't like fighting trans in PvP, man. It's so annoying, dude. Especially in duels, man. I thought bears were really bad to duel, but at least you can, like, bleed down a bear, you know? Hoping that they stay in bear form and they're not as smart to, you know, root you. Nah, like, not as smart to, uh, root you and run away and, uh, heal. It's freaking stupid. Uh, at least that's, that's my experience for a rogue. I don't really know what it's like for other classes. I'm sure it's probably easier for other classes, but for rogues... Even with me, like, just going full burst, if they have, like, a bunch of resilience on, dude, a resilience, a real good arena player, dude, it's stupid. I, I can't do anything about it, you know? A resilience druid, a druid that has some really high resilience on, and really big, thick, juicy heals. I hate it. It's very annoying. Because they literally sit there... They, they don't, sometimes, they'll sit there and literally just heal and just laugh in your face. I had that happen to me. I was dueling a guy in front of Karazhan, right, he's a druid healer, and he was in the right gear, right? He, he, he had some, we were basically like, same amount of gear. We had like Karazhan, a few pieces from heroics and badges, you know, we had some pretty decent, we both were pretty decently geared you know we could run raids this dude sat here literally did slash lol did slash lol and laughed in my face while i was trying to kill him i was trying so freaking hard dude he actually let me win i can tell he let me win he was barely his mana was barely even going down even when i did like big burst on him and this is, this is a guy that didn't even have resilience on it. Now, I was in my PvE spec because I was running around Karazhan at the time. But uh, I, I probably could have killed him if I was in PvP spec. Like, I, I would most definitely be able, been able to kill him if I was in my PvP spec. PvE spec, it's, it's a dramatic difference. There's a dramatic difference from PvE spec and PvP. For a rogue, at least, yeah. I have a lot of fun on Rogue, though. Even if I do have my struggles, you know, like with Druids, and have my struggles with other classes in PvP, and have my struggles with uh, PvE. I, well, I don't really struggle too much in PvP, or PvE, I mean. Uh, There's not really much to struggle on, you know. Just as long as you keep your threat down and your tanks are good. And you should be perfectly fine, you feel me? Ah! Like, as long as you keep your threat down and not try to pull like what I did right there. So, I'm over here trying to push- Oh my god, I'm pushing P right now with 1.5k. Jesus Christ, bro. Feel more powerful, it. Hmm. That was a quick kill. It's a very, very easy kill, dude. Oh, 
1.2k top damage. Hmm. Dude, that's crazy. You know, I, I keep thinking about the fact when I had when I went into Guru's Lair, right, dude? And I pushed like 950 damage. And I was holding it too. It wasn't like just a little 950 damage for a while and I didn't hold it. I was holding it. We and I couldn't, I was capping out at that. Dang, I'm dodging a lot. Look at this. This guy can't hit me. Did I have evasion up or something? I didn't even have evasion up. It was just dodging and ducking, huh? Oh, you can't do that. Why you heal on? God dang! I was finna he killed him too quick. Nah, you're not gonna be able to come in heroic and do this, man. You gotta you gotta do this in somewhere else. We just gonna have to kill this thing, man. Just kill it. Cause he's not gonna be able to tame this. Oh my god! Oh my god! Once again, another point why I like rogues. You just stealth and let your teammates die. You know, no worries. Easy claps. You know, just let them let them fall out and get clapped. Folded. Easy. In a whole entire heroic right now, dog. You trying to get this from? <laughs> you try to get it from freaking heroic? Like the fit? I mean, so what? I mean, so what if he has to level it a bunch? It's only like four levels, probably. So that's what I'm thinking. Like, why is he why is he rolling on this freaking helmet when your helmet is still? It has my helmet has more hit, but like, why do you want that much hit? My bleed is on it. Because we're hitting. Forget it, just kill it. Yeah. It's like, why do you want this specific pet? Is this pet like bis for freaking hunters or something? You got some bis pets? Dang, just go get one from, I don't know, from a normal dungeon in, like, uh, Steamboat. I don't know if they got, like, Beast in there. Underbog, I know they got Beast in Underbog. But probably get one from Steamboat, because it's higher level. Or, oh, no, probably, probably Blackmore. Suspect, bro, Blackmore's got a bunch of Beast, nothing but Beast in there. Tame something from there. Shoot. I don't know if they're tameable, but we could try Something from a normal. Like, I don't know. I I ain't play hunting, so I'm not gonna knock. I'm not gonna, you know. I'm not gonna really worry about it. But I'm guessing that's like a really good pet for a hunter if he wants it to the point where he'd literally die for it. Bro, I don't like this sizzling sound in my ear, dude. Honestly, we going kind of slow, man. This group kind of slowed down. I thought this was going to be a quick run, bro. I've been, we've been here for an hour straight. Well, not an hour. We started at like... Oh, I'm, I'm not supposed to be attacking. My bad. Let me... Let me do my... 
Dang, I hit him one time, deadly poison glow, bro. Hmm. He literally said, okay, don't attack this one. I started going ham on him. <laughs> was just finna wreck shop on him. Why did he feign death? And he trying to get aggro? And got a little, little paladin over here in care gear. Oh, that's gladiator gear. Okay. Oh, he ain't, he ain't really all that gear. So I can. <sighs> he had a card. Holy damage. Oh, he dead. Just kill it. Ah, I knew it. Okay, I was thinking, like, why is he trying to get this one? Aren't there other... Then why does he just get one from normal and then level it up? Like there's nothing wrong with that. Just level it up and switch between your pets. Cause you can you can put one in the stables. Like have your main raid pet with you that you mainly use, and then once you level your serpent up from normal, then just uh use that pet. Is the pet that you would normally use for raids. And once you get your cobalt serpent leveled up, and you can use your chain lightning and everything from normal. Then you can just switch and replace your pet out. So now you gotta have, you gotta be disciplined to do that. I don't know if it's hard to level uh, pets though. I'm gonna just skin them real quick though. So make some easy, some easy scraps. Wish he had a leather worker in the get. Dang! Instantly, just right off the bat, how did he see me? Anyway, so I was saying, I wish we had like a leather worker in the get in my guild though, cause I would be dope. Cause I ain't a leather worker, but I'm a skinner. This character was actually supposed to be meant to be like for me to get uh, easy gold. Just me trying to farm some gold, maybe I don't know. But no, nah, it's just I need to start trying to stun these guys. This freaking tank is getting. Dang. He's getting hit hard as heck. Well, he's not getting hard as heck, but it's just that it's scaring me, you know? Because this gear is pretty good, but it's decent. You can do like some heroics and get badges and get geared up like that, but freaking heals, it's like heals over time. That's one thing that I don't like about yours is their heals. Some of their heals, most of the heals that they go off of is heals over time. Uh, no, I don't know. Some I've, I've ran into a lot of healers that don't know really how to play, like druid healers, where they're not using like their big instant cast. So I'm really I'm not talking about all druid healers. It's not all druid healers. It's only a few druid healers that I've had that I've ran into that don't really know how to play. Now this person right here. I don't even know. We got Merciless. Slay Pins, Heroic Gear, Heroic. They got that. That's like, that's mid the heck. They got 5 Agility on it. Like, what? Is this, is this the healer? I didn't even know. Yeah, it's the healer. And you got 5 Agility on it, Boots. I guess his Boots suck anyway, I mean. But if your Boots gonna suck, don't let it suck. Just put like a... But something that's actually that you're actually gonna use, like some intellect or I don't know what druids use. Some freaking I'm feared. Oh shoot. Some intellect or I don't know. Even speed is good. Oh shoot! I tried to kick that. 
It's like something. How how much is he selling? Oh, he's selling for five hundred. I mean, it's I guess it's decent for his gear. I don't know. I, I I've never been a healer, so I'm not really going to talk about it too much. I don't know if that's good or not, but based off of what I've seen other healers do, uh, they do a high amount. But that's usually because the tank is taking a lot of damage and they have to heal big. But this tank ain't really taking too much damage to the point where this healer has to heal like huge heals. Because even at that, like, still I think you should at least be doing like 700 on a, on just like a normal, like just not a normal, like a normal dungeon, just regularly doing 700. Not actually trying, but I don't know. I never played a healer, so I'm not gonna talk about it too much. Just a lot of stamina, god dang! Man, these greens be having a bunch of stamina, man. Look at that stamina, 84 stamina. It's a, it's a dope looking mace. I like the way that stuff look. It's too bad, too bad it's green. Shoot. It came from a chest, though. I'm thinking we're gonna do Enzu after this one, after this last boss. Oh, I'm about to pull. I'm about to pull. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. Once again, Rogue is the best class. And if you think otherwise, and you're just. I don't know. If you think otherwise, and. At least you're somebody, you know. You're somebody that has a different opinion. And I would like to hear your opinion in the comments section, so yeah. Okay, we're finna die. I probably should have used my vanish on this wipe right here. I don't know if we're about to die, about to die. Because it's only like one of me. I'm the only DPS. And our healer is running out of mana. Uh, come on. This bear is surprisingly staying alive without a healer. Dang. Come on, get another cur- Oh, god dang. Yeager. Oh, my god. <laughs> Alright. That's crazy. Alright, I'm back. Back, come back for. Oh, shoot. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Ugh. Ah, dang, we pulled. Oh, no, this is wipe. Is it? I don't even know. I think it might be. Ah, I tried to say. Ah, dang it, I couldn't get him. I probably shouldn't come out. Oh, yeah, this is a wipe. God dang it. Look at this stuff, man. Hey, I'm, I'm I'm about to leave. This is dumb. This is stupid. Ah, uh, dang, bro, these fears are annoying. Let me kill this prophet over here. Focus on the wrong person.
trying to get this Anzu guy down. Not Anzu, last boss down. Get Anzu too, bro. Get Anzu too. I'm trying to get kill Anzu. Might be able to get that mount, bro. Mount kind of thick. I'm not gonna lie, because the mount is pretty good. It's pretty good looking. No cap. I just think it would look funny for a rogue to be riding on a raven. Like it would look silly. Having me looking real goofy. I'm doing really low damage in this freaking uh, area. Oh, what's going on with my damage? Saying, let's just go. Shoot. Let's, let's get it. What the fuck? What'd I do? Oh, I thought I pulled him. My god, dude. You said rot. Bro, squat. What the fuck? That's kind of crazy. That squat sound. It's kind of. Insane to the membrane. Let's go. Haha, <laughs> I resisted your polymorph. What a fag. God dang it, bro. What the heck was that? I've never heard that. Said find shelter. Oh wait, I was supposed to let him get aggro, huh? My bad. Oh shoot. Supposed to let this dude get aggro. Dang. Why is my damage so low? It's because his boss keeps doing this immune oh, shield. Thing. That's stupid. I keep hitting him without him actually grabbing aggro. Bro, can this guy get aggro, G? Dang. Trying to, trying to parse. Not parse, but like do damage, you feel me? Trying to push P. Push P and WoW mean push parse. That's what that means. And push and parse. Let's resist that polymorph real quick. I don't know if that's slice and dice. That's crazy. I ran. This is my first time running set the calls on Heroic on this character, and I seen these drop instantly by my warrior when I was still doing this in like phase two and one. Uh, I couldn't get them at all. That's funny. Well, I have them now, but like on my warrior, I had I had to run it like twenty times just to get them. Am I gonna get a res? Can I get a res or something? Can I get a res? <laughs> the figures they doing. Like, I would like to get a raise. I, I'm not getting no raise. What the is he doing, bro? Let's get it on. There's some cool looking shoulders if you have like a helmet that matches the shoulder. Shoulders are only cool if you have helmets that match the shoulders. Alright. First time doing Anzu. I put hugs on the mobs to help us. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Let's go.
Hail Mary. Screaming Hail Mary. There he is. We're going to clap his cheeks. Look at him. He already ready for us to mount him. We got the little mounted thing on him right there. Oh, shoot. Dude pulled it. I dropped him instantly. Whoa! Whoa! I like can't pull aggro, bro. Sheesh. I bring out my little pumpkin pets. Ooh, that paladin. Ooh, fat, juicy heels. Oh, his mom's around us. So now, let me get my bleed up. God dang it. Paralyzing Screech? What did I do? I don't even know. Oh, so he's just like killing each other's mobs or something? Or are we just like alien them down? Why is expression getting so hard? The fuck? There we go. So that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Can I resist this paralyzing screech? No, I cannot. All right. Bro, especially stop doing hurricane, bro. You're gonna pull aggro on this guy, and it's gonna be freaking stupid, annoying. That's just heal. You're wasting your freaking mana on stuff for no reason. How many paralyzing screeches we don't have, man? Here we are just screeching for now. Oh, god dang. Hurry up! Heal! Heal! Oh my gosh. Right. 36%. Awaken my children and assist your massa. Are we killing the Falcon Spirits? I like how it's called AOE. That's pretty cool. Growl Bear. I had to finish that already. That was nice. Do the Falcon Spirits even do anything? I don't know what Falcon Spirits do. And the Paralyzing Screech is coming out of his form. Come on, hurry up. Alright. Now my AOE is coming. Bro, oh my god, can we just kill the freaking boss, dog? Like, dang, why you keep doing this AOE? Oh, okay, we, we got this, we killing him. Ooh. Right. <clears throat> he finna die, ooh. Thick, juicy clap. Oh, it's not 100% drop, alright. I thought it was. Why did they say, holy Jesus? Like, what the fit? What the heck did for? Yeah, it's a tank gun, it's a boomstick. I ain't never seen that before. Uh, no boomstick. Oh, dang. Oh. Uh. Shoot, man. Anyways, bro, I gotta go. I'm so strange. Peace out.